the mighty British Empire, which is almost at the thing of running, of winning the Second World War, was in have was in alliance with the. Entire this thing of from United States or the right and things like that, etc. He was challenging and he said that he was going to attack India, but he did attack. He did reach the fall. He was able to get this thing of the Mapur. And when Prime Minister Attlee was told, and he came to Cal this thing and he was staying with the Chief Justice at that time, he said, "Why did you leave India? After all, you had won the Second World War. Gandhi had almost got this thing on that." This thing like that, the worst was over. The, Bharat, the Quit India movement was uh, had flopped in 1942. What was such much a tearing hurry in 47 that you said that no, we have to go immediately? He said it was not that. It was the spark that Bose had created among the soldiers of the Indian Army, and we had seen 1857, 2.5 million. 25 lakh Indian soldiers had returned from victorious from the Second World War, and when the incidents like this started taking place, there was this thing revolt in the Karachi Naval Dock base, there was this thing in Jabalpur, there was this thing in um, uh, Asansol, and so many places, and people joined the INA. He said, "We knew we will not be able to take this country and hold this country. It was the threat of Subhash Bose, a rising of Indian nationalism." That we knew it's a matter of time, and if we do not quit voluntarily, we will quit in a way that will be, there will be a bloodbath. So they believe in themselves. When he says, "Tum mujhe khun do, main tumhe azadi dunga," do you know how much of a blood he gave? It is the sole example in the in the annals of warfare. Where two third attrition what took place in the Indian National Army, two third people died of their entire strength of sixty thousand, and still they kept on fighting, and were even tried in independent India after that. And the government never rehabilitated the, this thing or integrated them into the into the Indian Army. But anyway, that's a separate story. I'm not talking about Subhash Bose here, but I'm talking about the belief. So if you have got a belief. If you have got a dream, first is this: Do you believe yourself that you can do it? If you want to make a business empire, or if you want to have a great um, uh, um, uh, business consultancy firm, or if you want to convert your this thing like that, do you believe in yourself, in your ability, your commitment, your courage, your sense of sacrifice to do that? If you can. Again, I would like to repeat: leaders are ordinary people with extraordinary determination, and that determination comes because of the fact that they believe. You know, I I I, I think the history is full.